Hi everyone, Teresa here and welcome to my everyday. Today I'm going to do um, some dollar store hauls. I actually went to two different dollar stores today. I'm going to start off with the Dollar Tree. Um, I did a lot of shopping at the Dollar Tree today. I uh, was just running around and having kind of a crap day and thought, what do I need to do to feel better? And I thought, yep, yeah, I'm gonna go to the Dollar Tree and I walked in and as usual, there were some great stuff in there. I'm a pretty frequent shopper of the dollar stores. We have two Dollar Trees in my city and about, I don't know, six Dollaramas. So um, let's get started. I'm sure some of this stuff will be pretty random, so I'll try not to be too long and too boring. But uh, the first thing that I got was uh, a set of two fleck chopping mats just for my vegetables because my other ones kind of all scratched up um, but one other thing that I found that I was actually really excited about it was the first thing that I found when I got in and it was this colorful duct tape um, and I actually plan on doing a video sometime in the future about all the great things that I actually like to do with colorful fun duct tape but I found a whole bunch um, and it's funny actually because when I walked in I found a bunch of different colors in the tool bench hardware brand um, and I found pink and red and green and blue and black and I got really excited because my daughter's actually having a birthday party um, and we wanted to wrap the labels of her water bottles in different colors because she wants to have a Teen Titans Go birthday party and so these are all the colors that go with her birthday theme um, so I picked up blue and green and black and red and pink and then on my way out um, I actually found the Scotch duct tape brand and the Scotch brand has 20 yards of tape and it had the purple which we really wanted because her favorite is Raven and Raven is purple and black and anyway. Um, so I traded all the colors that I had that were the same for the Scotch brand. Um, so I got the red in the Scotch brand and the purple and the pink i don't know how well you can see that um but i did end up keeping the tool bench hardware brand duct tape in the green and in the blue just because the green that they had in the scotch brand was very um it was like a light almost um sagey kind of color and i really wanted this brighter darker green um now it only has 10 yards instead of the 20 but because we really want it for the party i got it and they didn't have the blue in the scotch brand so i ended up getting it in the uh tool bench hardware brand which only gave us 10 yards but for a dollar 25 which here in canada dollar tree everything is a dollar 25 um it's not bad so i got those um, I also got for her birthday party, uh, I want to design my own invitation so that we can do the Teen Titans Go picture, whatever she chooses to do and write our own information. So I got the premium photo paper in the uh, 4x6 I believe, yep. So there's 20 of them in there and so I'm going to use this um, for her invitation. So I'm going to make my own invitations and I was looking around for um, envelopes. Um, and I found these blank card and envelope sets and they came in the, just trying to let you see, in the pink. Um, and you got 10 for $1.25, so I got two just so I could use the envelopes and I'll still use the cards without the envelopes. So I thought that was a really good buy. I also picked up, um a USB cord. My son unplugged one of his tablets and yanked the cord really hard and it's kind of wonky now so I'm just going to give it a try. I figure for $1.25 it's not that bad so we'll, we'll give that a try. I know it's from the dollar store so it probably won't be a great cord but if it works it works. Um, so on to the next bag. Um, I don't usually buy food items at the dollar store but I was intrigued by these Disney Fruit Crisp uh, freeze dried. They had real sliced strawberries and bananas. And they also had the freeze dried pears. Um, and I, I was interested because I looked at the ingredients and it's literally 100% freeze dried pears and 100% freeze dried berries and bananas, strawberries and bananas. And so there's no added sugar or juices or anything like that. So I thought I would give those a try for myself. And then I also picked up one of each for my son. 
So I picked those up. Um, I also picked up in the food section. I know I don't usually pick up food, but I did pick up these Nature Valley Protein um, Peanut Almond and Dark Chocolate Bars. Um, I've tried them before and they're very yummy and I like that they're relatively filling. Um, I'm going to throw them in my car actually because sometimes I'm on the go and I don't have time to have breakfast and I'm running around and then by the time lunch is coming I'm headed home but I don't want to stop and get any junk food so this is good. It's got 11 grams of protein which is something that I really like. Um, it's within... I forget what it said, how much sugar it had in it. Um, eight grams of sugar. So I like to keep things under about 10 grams of sugar. So I thought that was good for me. So I picked up two of those and then throw them in my car so, uh, just for an emergency when I'm hungry and there's nothing else. Um, another thing that I got, oh, there's the black of the scotch tape. It just got put in a different bag. I also picked up these My Little Pony pocket tissues. You get six. Sorry about the lighting in here. I've got a window right in front of me. It's really bright, so it's coming in I'm a little dark behind me. So I'm new to this. I'm going to try and figure out better ways, but right now I'm going to have to kind of work with what we have. Um, but yeah, so I got the My Little Pony the pocket tissues um, for my daughter. Uh, she really loves, she's obsessed with My Little Pony. So I thought these would be really cute to put in her um, backpack. Um, so yeah, six of those for $1.25, not bad. Um, I also got these cellophane uh, treat bags with twist ties. You get 25 of them. Um, they've got little hearts. Again, sorry about the lighting. So I thought, uh, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with these. I make my own bath bombs, so I thought maybe I could put some bath bombs in here. Um, give them out as gifts or store them in here. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I also got myself a spatula because I'm forever looking for spatulas for things. Um, and I got it with a nice green handle because it's easy to find in the drawer. Um, also got myself some gelatin fruit pectin crystals. And I got this because I'm actually going to try and make my own fruit gummies. Uh, see how that works. I've been watching a lot of uh, YouTube channels. Um, and you got some good ones out there. So I've been watching a lot of... Uh, different DIYs and I want to try and make my own fruit snacks. So I also got these two notebooks and they're actually um, monthly calendar notebooks with a sleeve in them so, whoops, so that you can put like receipts or so I was thinking I do run my own home business um, so I was thinking uh, when I'm out and about and I bring home a receipt and I want to file it, then I can just stick it in the appropriate month. And if there's any expense notes that I need to write, um, I can put them in there. So this one is actually one that I got for my sister, which if she's watching, which I'm sure she will, she probably watched before anyone else. Um, this is for her. So I got this for her because she also runs her own little home business. And um, I got this cute, fun, pretty patterned one for myself. On to the next bag. Told you I did a lot of shopping today. All right, so I got um, this water bottle and I actually already have an orange one and a pink one that I got a few weeks back and I love them. I love them to put water in. I love it to put fruit infused water. Um, I find that it helps me uh, stick to drinking my water for the day and I thought I need to pick up another one in case the other one breaks or I lose it. Um, I also really like switching out the lids. I find that really fun. So here's the other one that I got. So there's the pink and I switched out, out the lid for the orange and I got the orange and I switched out the lid for the pink. So those are the ones I got before and today I got the green one and I think they're a lot of fun. They're really cute. $1.25. Um, they're very similar to I think the Contigo brand or the Voss, so I think they're a great buy. Um, I also got a aluminum spray bottle um, for, I was thinking of using it on my daughter's hair in the morning and so that way we know this is hers, maybe put a little tea tree oil in it, um, spray it in her hair, so I got one of those. Also for my daughter, she loves animal print, so I got her this little shoe. And it ha you can put your rings in it. So she started to wear some, some rings, mostly costume jewelry. But, you know, it's fun. So I thought I'd get her this little shoe to put in her room to keep her rings in. I also got her this little trash bin thing. 
And I thought it was super duper cute for her Barbie dollhouse. She could pretend that it's the recycling bin or the trash bin or the, the green bin or whatever bin she wants to use it for for trash for her doll. So I thought that was really cute. And for my son, I got him. Sometimes he gets um, money for his birthday and he goes out and spends it and there's change and then we need to put it somewhere. And we don't really have a piggy bank for him, so usually I just keep it in a separate compartment of my purse. And so I got him this little Lightning McQueen cars, little mini wallet, and so it just zips up and then you can put his money in it. Uh, also got myself some scissors, just cause you can't ever have too many scissors. And a couple more things in here. I got myself, I thought these were super cute. I got myself some Sally and Chic glue nails, fashion nails, glue not included. So I got these and I got them because, I don't know if you can see, they have little flamingos on them. And I thought they were just super cute. But even if they last like a day or two, they're just super cute. And so I did buy the glue because it doesn't come with glue. So I did get the Sally not Sally, Sassy and Chic Glue. Um, I haven't ever tried this glue, so I will try it and maybe I'll do a review on that. But I love the nails, I thought they were super, super cute. Let me see if I can put little flamingos on them. So anyway, those are cute and I like them. And the other thing that I got at the Dollar Tree, I think that's the last of the Dollar Tree items that I got, was this um, Our Impressions of Victoria's Secret a bombshell in bloom it comes with a body lotion and a little um, perfume for your purse so I thought that was really cute and I smelled it in the store it was the last one of this kind and I really liked it so I thought I would throw this in my purse so I thought that was really cute so I thought it was all done and then I'm driving home and then I realized mm, I'm gonna pass a Dollarama so Let's go into Dollarama. So I went into Dollarama. I did actually go on a mission, but I didn't find what I wanted. I found a whole bunch of other stuff. So I went into Dollarama, and not very exciting, but I did buy some little gift bags. I like the color. They're just the paper craft ones. And two of them for a dollar. So I got those. And I also got this 100% extra virgin olive oil spray. And the reason that I really... Uh, was excited about this is I eat a lot of salad and I don't like to put a ton of olive oil on my salad but I do like oil and vinegar and so I thought oh a spray might be easier to control how much I put on so I did try that it was two dollars um, instead of a dollar but I thought it was a pretty good buy so I got that and I also got um, this pure and natural rosemary and mint conditioner it's hypoallergenic and paraben free which caught my eye it was two dollars and uh, I like the smell so uh, I'm kind of in the market for a new conditioner uh, I hoarded a whole bunch of the conditioner that I used to use and I'm actually getting to the end of it, it actually doesn't smell as good anymore and I think it's because I bought way too many and the scents just kind of dying away so I'm gonna try this and if I like it I'll buy some more if not then I'll have to try something else but I was excited about it, it smells good and I like the fact that it is hypoallergenic and paraben free so two dollars not too bad and the last bag here oh this one's kind of heavy all right so I did pick up, uh, again, I don't usually do food, but I have tried this before and it's not bad. The Organic Original uh, Certified Soy Beverage. It's $1.50 at the Dollarama, so, and my kids like soy milk. And I also picked up, I've never tried these before, and I don't really, I'm not usually a fan of artificial uh, scents, but I picked up the Crystal Beads. Let's see if I can, there we go. And they were two dollars and I just really like the smell and I thought even if I just put it in my laundry room um, it's not gonna kill me right so I thought I would try it because I do really like the smell so I thought I would give that a try I've seen a lot of people haul those in other videos so I thought why not try it and the last thing that I got at the Dollarama was the Epsom salts in the lavender um, I've used the other Epsom salts that they have there and I really like them and I actually use them when I make my homemade bath bombs So I thought I would try the lavender and see how I like it. So um, Yeah, I'm gonna give it a try see how how it is so that's it for my Dollar Tree and Dollarama haul 
Um, again, I'm fairly new to this, so I appreciate any thumbs up. Uh, if you want to subscribe to my channel, hope to be doing lots more videos like this because like I said, I am at the dollar store a lot. So um, yeah, thanks for watching and I hope to do more videos in the future. Um, hope to see you again soon. Bye.